You have question time in a moment. We're not going nowhere because we got a meeting anyway. Y'all can hang with me tonight, right? Okay. All right. Get Exodus, I mean, get um, Psalms 83, and let's start at the first verse. Psalms 83 and 1. Keep not thou silence, O, o power. Hold not thy peace, and be not still, O power. For lo, thy enemies make a tumult. So and the they... enemies are, are the other nations that are following these other gods. A tumult is an uprising. Read. And they that hate thee have lifted up their heads. So the nations hate the Most High because they don't... Because they're following other gods, and, and they don't believe in keeping the commandments of the Most High. When you break the commandments of the Most High, that's a sign of hatred towards Him. Read. Verse 3. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people. So you and other nations and these governments of this earth have taken crafty counsel against God's people. Y'all come together and one consent is going to show that. Read. And consulted against thy hidden ones. And they all have consulted against the Most High hidden ones. The Most High's people are hidden because your historians have been lying on them. All the greatness of his people have been skewed and lied on. And you, you have put, put up your people in history over God's people. Read. They have said, come, and let us cut them off from being a nation. They said what? Come, and let us cut them off from being a nation. Let's set up historians and cut the children of Israel off from being a nation. So instead of them seeing themselves, somebody give me that Caesar Boger book. Where that guy at? Let me see if I got him up in here. Let me see if I have him. They said what? Come, and let us cut them off from being a nation. Let's cut, hold up. Let's cut them off from being a nation. There you go. Let's tell them that we're Jesus Christ. Why are they not trying to be... Why, why the other nations are not trying to be each other? I don't never see... I don't never see... Uh, I've never seen the Catholic Church trying to, <laughs> trying to play... trying to act like Buddha was white. Why they got to hide our history? Let us cut them off from being a nation. Not only did, did they put up this guy to be an Israelite, and this dude was an Italian. Now, how do you get that? How do you get Israel out of an Italian, man? They're not the only people that did this. Okay? The Africans did it. By lying and calling us Hyksos. Because you could not hide the fact that people were living in your land over 200, 300 years. So you had to call it a different name. Read that part again. What did they say they're going to do? They have said, come, and let us cut them off from being a nation. Let's cut the children of Israel off from being a nation, read. That the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. So that people will not remember that they are the children of Israel. So let's call them Hyksos. Oh, they, that's not a people. Oh, let's call them Asiatic. And it's the people without an identity scrambling to get an identity, and you wonder why. And the only thing you can point to is the white man. The white man could not have did this by himself. The Africans did it to you too. Wake up, you guys that are in Egyptology. You're going from one slave place to another. Oh, yeah, I, w I was free in Egypt. You were a slave in Egypt. We were kings until Ramesses II said, get them out of the land before they become too great and take us down. And they started killing us. They started killing our man child. That's why Moses had to survive on the waters into Egypt. They were killing us, man, and you're trying to uphold the Egyptians. Read. Verse 5, for they have consulted together with, with one consent. They are a confederate against thee. They are a confederate against us. All the nation's governments are against us. They've hit us. Why? Because we are more valuable to them sleep. 
they can still use our spirit to gain access and, and to gain finances in the earth. They can use our hands and our will and our manpower and our women. But how can they use it if we decide to start using it for ourselves? So they must lie to us. They have to keep the lie going to take advantage of our spirit, to come up on our ignorance. So the nations need us to need us sleep. Read that last part again. For they have consulted together with one consent. They are, co they are a confederate against thee. They are a confederate against us. Read. The tabernacles of Edom. Edom is the so-called white man. Now, this is the governments of the Edomites. There are good white people that have been lied to as well as our people. But the governments of the Edomites are the head people that are, be that are behind the lie of hiding the children of Israel. Here's a perfect example. Chinese people didn't do this. Even Africans didn't do this. Okay? Arabs didn't do this. Arabs made up their own, their own prophet, uh, Muhammad. But Edom were the first people that put up their own people as the children of Israel. And I'll tell you this, even the Egyptians had enough respect not to call themselves Hyksos. They didn't identify themselves with us at all. They just separated themselves, but not Edom. Edom said, listen, I'm going to be me and you too. There ain't nothing you can do about it. I'm everybody. Yes, I'm the Romans. And I'm the Jews that we chased into Africa. <laughs> I'm the Romans and the Jews. Y'all, you people, y'all too dumb to ever figure it out anyway because y'all don't read. I'm going to put up an Italian to be you. <laughs> y'all don't know any better. Here's an Italian for you. Here's your God. Call him Jesus. Here he is. Eat him. Read. The tabernacles of Edom. Go ahead. The Ishmaelites. The Ishmaelites. Right under Edom is who? Say it again. And the Ishmaelites.